guys, it's Grace from Grace Gets Gastric, and I'm here today for my third, third <laughs> what I eat in a day video. So this is what I eat in a day, three months post-op, and I decided to do a uh, fitness or workout edition. So this is what I eat in a day, um, on a day when I work out. Uh, the actual amount of food I eat doesn't necessarily vary. I know for some people they find themselves hungrier, they eat more on days they work out. I haven't really found that to be the case for me so far. I don't feel any hungrier, but the cadence of when I work out I, I is a little bit different. So, or sorry, the cadence of when I eat maybe. And I drink a lot more water on days that I work out. So I just thought I would do this uh, workout edition. Sorry guys, I am tired today. And please excuse the hair. It looks uh, like a crazy person, but it was really like rainy and humid and drizzly out and so my hair just like poofed up. Um, what can you do? So yeah, this is going to be the my what I eat in a day for a day that I worked out in the morning. Um, I don't think you guys need any more information. I will come back at the end with stats for the day. Sorry. <laughs> Hope you enjoy. Good morning. It is 6.02. I am just about to go to the gym. So first order of business is I have 10 ounces of water here mixed with one scoop of this lit Beyond Raw Lit Watermelon Pre-Workout. So I'm going to take that along with my morning vitamins. So this is my Meprazole, my Biotin, and uh, a lemon calcium chew. Um, there is some calories and carbs in the pre-workout, so I'll go ahead and put those on the screen, and I will see you for breakfast. Okay, friends, it is 8.48. I am at work, and I am about to have my breakfast. So I had um, that 10 ounces of pre-workout before I worked out, and then during my workout I had 16 ounces of water, and then on the way from my workout to work, I had another 16 ounces, so I'm at 42 ounces for the day already, which is always nice. Um, for my breakfast, I'm having three ounces of this organic French roast cold brew coffee concentrate from Trader Joe's with a premier protein chocolate. And um, I just put that in my blender bottle. And then I'm also going to have my second lemon calcium chew. So I'll put the stats somewhere on the screen. Okay, fam, it is 11.55 and I am hungry, so I'm gonna eat my lunch. Um, I am almost done with this 25 ounce bottle of water. I just have a little bit left and I am going to use it to take my next set of vitamins. So this is my daily multivitamin and I just started taking a fish oil. Um, that was listed as one of the supplements my re surgeon recommends taking if I wanted. Um, after three months. I wasn't actually planning on it, but I went to get vitamins with my sister the other day and they had buy one get one free and she only needed one. So I decided what the hell, I'll try it. So once I take my vitamins, uh, these are both, these are um, good to be taken before, right before a meal. So then I'm going to have my lunch, which is three ounces of um, marinated chicken thigh. I got it from this amazing Caribbean place and I had about enough for three meals. So this is the last of those chicken thighs. So um, I don't have the exact 100% accurate stats because I don't know exactly what the marinade is, but I just assumed kind of like a teriyaki chicken marinade and I'll put the stats for that, approximate stats for that here. All right guys, it's 2.23 and I'm back for my afternoon snack. So I just finished um, the second uh, thing of water, 25 ounces. I had that flavored with this strawberry kiwi Dasani drop flavoring, pretty good. I'm going to have my final calcium chew of the day, and my snack is a serving or half an ounce of um, these pork rinds. These are the Mac pork rinds in the barbecue flavor. They are fantastic. I highly recommend. Okay, it is 4.07. I am about to take my final vitamin of the day, which is this chewable probiotic. I just finished my third bottle of this 20 ounce bottle of water. This one was just plain. And I just wanted to note that I have had three pieces of this Trident Watermelon Twist gum today. I'll put the stats on the screen. I don't normally track gum, to be honest, partially because it's just a low calorie thing and 
mostly just because I'm too lazy to track um, for the relatively few calories, but you know, they do technically count, so since I'm tracking today for YouTube, I'll be super thorough. All right, friends, I am back home and it is 4.56. I'm about to have dinner. I am super hungry. Normally I have a bigger snack than just the pork rinds, but I wasn't hungry at the time, but now I'm super hungry. Anyways, this is my dinner. It is three, about three and a half ounces of this deconstructed brown butter walnut sage uh, ravioli. There's air quotes around that ravioli. So it's like zoodles and rotisserie chicken breast and a bunch of really yummy stuff. It's really good. I got the recipe from Chemistry Queenie on her Instagram. Um, I will link the, the recipe that she posted on her Instagram below. I basically made it exactly the same, except for I did a half recipe, and then I added eight ounces of uh, chopped rotisserie chicken breast for some extra protein. But I'll put the stats of mine up here now. All right, guys, I'm back for my final meal of the day. It is 7.02, and I am about to have half of this uh, Fit Crunch bar in cookies and cream. Uh, this is like the big version. They have big ones and small ones, so, you know, half of it is sort of like a regular protein bar size. I'll put the stats on the screen. Um, I really like these bars. I haven't actually tried the cookies and cream flavor before, uh, but I bought all of the flavors to try because I really liked the um, chocolate peanut butter one. And so far, actually, I like all of them. So hopefully I like this one too. All right, guys, I have finished with my dessert. And I think I'm pretty much done for the day. I'm about to go to bed, take off my makeup, do a little bit of reading. Um, I'll put the stats for the day here. Uh, it was actually a little bit lower calorie than I had been anticipating. I have budgeted for a little bit more calories, but I just wasn't as hungry as I was expecting. Um, so yeah, I also got, let's see, a little over 11,000 steps. Um, and I'll put, I think, my water up on the screen as well so yeah I think that's pretty much everything <clears throat> I hope you guys enjoyed uh, this is what I eat in a day I really make enjoy making them I mentioned that before um, I think the next one that I make I will probably try to do like a weekend today because those do tend to be a little bit different as well just with timing etc so have a great day you guys and I will talk to you later bye